Hello, Symbol Speakers, and welcome to our second tutorial video. Um, if you have not watched our app tour video, you might find that one helpful as far as guidance around the symbol display and the record button. Today we'll be discussing our symbol display settings. So the first thing I'm going to do is put a phrase into the app. So let's get started. Would you like a drink with your sandwich and almonds? Okay, so first thing you'll notice is, of course, our transcription in the bottom left and our symbols in the center of the screen. Today we'll be discussing our symbol display settings, so we're going to be changing how the symbol display actually looks. So in our menus we found in the bottom center, we're going to start with this first tab on the left, symbol display. The first thing I'm going to do is change our symbol size by coming over here and moving us from small to extra large, which could be very helpful if you're working with someone who has trouble seeing the smaller symbols. So that took immediate effect, you'll notice. Um, and now our symbols are so large that we actually can't see them all in the symbol display box. So I'm gonna come back into my menu and turn on scroll, which is extremely helpful when you are using the extra large or large setting to be able to see all of the symbols that you put into um, the display box. And then the next thing I'm going to do is turn on show words. So if you ever forget what this setting does, you can click this handy little eye, which will display an explanation at the bottom. So this displays text in the absence of a corresponding word. So when I turn this on and go back, we actually see that the word almonds, which does not have a symbol correlate in the PCS symbol set, um, still displays in my um, sentence just as a single word without a symbol, which could be helpful. And then um, in the color coding setting, I'm gonna turn this on last, and our color coding matches the modified Fitzgerald color coding system. So when I go back to my main screen, You'll notice that they're instead of having blue tops, they now match the modified Fitzgerald color coding system. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. Please give us some feedback and have a great day.